Welcome to Device Help Support. Your ultimate destination for everything related to device setup, troubleshooting, and optimizing your tech experiences. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos related to setup, troubleshooting, and unboxing. And don't forget to press the bell icon so you don't miss our latest videos. In today's video we will discuss how to set up D-Link DAPX1870AX1800 Wi-Fi Range Extender. If you're looking for the best extender that gives you the perfect Wi-Fi range coverage, then this video is specially made up for you. So without wasting any time let's start the setup process. I hope in the end, this video will prove helpful for you. First of all we will discuss what's inside the extender box. Inside the D-Link DAPX1870AX1800 Wi-Fi range extender box, you'll find the range extender itself, a quick installation guide, and a warranty card. Some packages may also include a network cable for a wired connection. Now plug the DAPX1870 into a power outlet near your router. Wait for the LED to turn solid or blink, depending on the model, indicating it's ready for setup. On your computer, tablet, or smartphone, open the Wi-Fi settings. Look for the network name, SSID, like DAPX1870XXXX, this will match the sticker on the device. Connect to this network. It should not require a password initially, but if it does, check the default password on the sticker. Open a web browser, like Chrome, Firefox, or Safari. In the address bar, Type http colon slash slash dlinkcap.local or http colon slash slash 192.168.0.50, both should work. If this doesn't load, try clearing your browser cache or restarting the extender. You should see the D-Link login screen. Use the default login credentials, username is admin or password is, leave this blank or use the default on the device sticker, if this is your first time logging in, you may be prompted to create a new password for security. After logging in, the setup wizard should automatically start. If not, click on Setup or Extender Setup in the menu. Choose the Range Extender mode or Extend an Existing Network option. The extender will scan for available Wi-Fi networks. Select your main Wi-Fi network from the list. Enter the password for your main Wi-Fi network when prompted. If you have a dual-band router, 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz, you may need to repeat this step for each band. Choose whether you want the extended network to have the same name, SSID, as your main network or a different one. Using the same name allows for seamless roaming, while a different name can help you identify the extender's network separately. Review your settings to ensure everything is correct. Click Apply or Save to finalize the configuration. The extender will reboot to apply the new settings, which may take a minute or two. Once the setup is complete, unplug the extender and move it to a location halfway between your router and the area needing a stronger signal. I hope this video will prove helpful for you. If you're stuck in middle of the process then don't worry. Contact our professional experts at 1-323-507-3713. They will solve your problem as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe devices help and support. And also stay tuned for the more updates.